here in Victory Lane at Darlington Raceway with Richard Boswell, the crew chief of the number 14, who is now a Southern 500 champion. You're also punched your ticket in the NASCAR Cup Series playoffs. Emotions were high for this team, I know, going into this one, but especially there at the end. What were you feeling when you knew that you guys were going to win it? Well, I don't necessarily knew that I we were going to win it until we got off of turn four. Um, I knew Kyle would, would throw it down in there into turn three, and um, I mean, he's just a class act, right? He races hard, but he races clean, and, and we respect that and we appreciate that. Um, but yeah, you know, this is a surreal moment for all of us. We've been through a lot at this organization this year, and, and you know, our, our, our kind of mantra for the team has just been, let's control what we can control. And, and we had a really tough go in the middle of the summer months, and you know, it, it, when things get tough within the team, it's hard, right? And, Chase and I had a good talk this week, and um, you know he promised me he was going to bring his best, and, and I told the guys we were going to bring our best, and, and that's what everybody did. So just super proud of them. I know with Stuart Haas Racing, there is a lot of people who don't know what they're doing for their future. It's the last year of this racing organization. What does this do? What spark does this add to the men and women at SHR? Well, you know, as soon as this happened, you know, I sent as many people as I knew names and numbers for everybody on this 14 team because they're they're one of the best groups in the garage. I truly believe that. And they've made my job when I came into this deal about a year ago super easy. Um, and I'm just super thankful for all of them. This is a credit to all of their hard work. This is a credit to the race cars that they build. And everybody at Stewart Haas Racing has been through a lot this year. So I think this just credits the fact that, that we are a, a race winning organization and super proud to be able to be the ones to get us there. Finally, we head to three racetracks that are all very different, very intense for their own reasons. How do you attack these next three weeks with the 14 team? You know, honestly, I would say until tonight, Atlanta was our best race of the year. We had a great car. Chase was super aggressive all night long. We got caught in a, a late race incident that took us out of contention for the win. So I look at that as an opportunity for us to go up, go in there and, and, and find our way into the round of 12. So um, after that, Watkins Glen and Bristol. Watkins Glen, we had a good car last year. And, and Bristol, we got to do the tire test there this year. So we're looking forward to all three of them. All right. Welcome to the playoffs. Congratulations. Thank you very much.